Hello everyone, this is David from Automotive Press. And today I wanted to give you a quick update on my 2020 GR Supra that I've now owned for more than a year. And the reason why is because I've uh, upgraded the wheels and tires on this Supra, which makes surprising amount of difference to the way the car feels on the road and also on the highway. So as an automotive engineer with uh, extensive background in testing and evaluation, I'm going to explain to you exactly what happens when you upgrade the wheels and tires and exactly what can you expect as an output or the result of those changes. Most people don't really think about upgrading their wheels and tires because it costs a fair amount of money. But what uh, they don't realize is that uh, even a small amount of investment can yield really huge improvement in the way that car handles and rides. And you might be surprised that uh, your a car that might be a few years old can be literally resurrected with a set of new wheels and tires. So let me explain to you exactly what I did with the Supra and what did I receive as an output or result from all those changes. Let me walk you through that right now. Now I did something above and beyond what most people would do because first I changed the uh, summer wheel and tires of the Supra to a larger, more aggressive wheels and tires. But I also um, end up equipping the Supra with the uh, all season tires for the winter time. So I end up with actually three sets of tires. The original summer tires, the upgraded summer tires, and the all season tires for the winter use. And also I have two sets of wheels. One is the original equipment manufacturing wheels. Those are the ones that came with the Supra. And on those, I installed the all season tires as a winter package. And then I purchased a larger wheels for the more aggressive summer package. Now these are the latest Michelin tires, which I will talk about in a minute. And these have substantially upgraded the feel of the Supra to the point where when I compare this to something much more expensive, like the Porsche 911 I'm driving this week, there's not as much difference in the capability and the performance characteristic of the two cars. Now, before I go too far with details, just a full disclosure, I'm not your typical car owner because I have over 35 years of automotive engineering and evaluation and testing experience. So I'm pretty finicky and very picky about how I select my tires and wheels and how I choose to drive these cars. So in my case, I have a very selective way of upgrading wheels and tires and the result must meet my expectation as an automotive engineer. So it took a while for me to figure out exactly what I'm going to do in terms of tires and wheels for this Supra. Uh, so let me walk you through right now what was changed. Now the basic standard GR Super already come with an amazing set of 19 inch wheels and tires that are top notch and most people wouldn't have to change them but I knew based on my automotive engineering background that if I can upgrade the tire size, the wheel size and change what we call the offset, I can make this Supra not only look much better but also perform better as well. So I went into full investigation mode to figure out exactly what kind of tires and wheels would first of all fit into this Supra if I were to upgrade from 19 inch to 20 inch and to avoid having problems like the tires rubbing inside the wheel well. So I maximized the tire size and also the wheel size and you can see they fit uh, really really tight inside the wheel wells uh, but uh, they are still very comfortable and they do not rub it at all when I'm turning. So what I end up with are a set of Michelin Pilot Sport Forest tires which I would say are the best summer tires in the world. These are the latest compounds with latest engineering built into them and they provide amazing performance and capability without compromising ride or quietness. They're shockingly good to the point where if I were to buy any other type of sports cars in the future, I would instantaneously upgrade the tires to Michelin Pilot Sport 4S. These are definitely not your ordinary summer tires. They provide an ultimate performance in a surprisingly refined and smooth ride. And the sizes I've chosen are 275, 30, 20 in the front 
and 295 3020 in the rear. The original tires that came with the Supra were actually 255 3590 in the front and 275 35 19 in the rear so i went uh, two centimeter wider both front and back and also went from 19 inch to 20 inch so it's a very substantial change and the entire package end up looking way better because the tires really fill inside that uh, wheel wells now because the tires are lower profile which are 30 series in these 20 inch wheels versus 35 series in the original 19 inch wheels people might be worried that the ride will be too stiff that's why i went a bit wider by adding two centimeter front and back to 275 and 295 even though they are not exactly the original spec because i knew that i would get a little bit more profile around the wheels providing a little bit more of a comfortable ride and the overall result is really shockingly good i just didn't expect to be able to improve the handling and the performance characteristic and also substantially improve the cornering because it's so much more flatter but without uh, almost any compromises because the ride is still very smooth and I might even say that it's a bit quieter than the summer tires that it came with originally. So I am absolutely impressed with these set of tires and I can't recommend them enough. In terms of wheels, I specifically went out to look for wheels that are amazing in design but somewhat unique. So these are variant wheels, maybe not as common as other brands that we see for aftermarket installations, but I think these are fantastic looking designs and they look quite unique in terms of design characteristics. I think they are pretty unique and they fit the Supra really well. Let me know what you think of these wheels in terms of design and how they fit into the Supra. I can't recommend the variant uh, wheels enough. Their customer service have been absolutely world class. And again, I didn't want to go with some of the more common uh, brands which can be seen in many different cars these days. In terms of the actual spec of these wheels, they are 20 by 10 inches in the front with a 29 millimeter offset and in the rear they are 20 by 11 inches with a 32 millimeter offset so they are definitely wider than the standard oem wheels you can tell that the wheels are so wide that they stick out a little bit of the tires but a lot of people like this look because they kind of provide that really aggressive feel and again it didn't affect my ride quality so i'm pretty happy with the way they perform on the road even over rough roads uh, these wheels and tires are like a perfect combination for the gr supra i will put the link below for both the michelin tires and the wheels but uh, the wheels are called the variant xenon satin gunmetal with blood red center cap so again they're pretty unique not as common and you can specify exactly the type of offset you want but for the supra these end up being 29 millimeter in the front and 32 millimeter in the back as i mentioned for some funny reasons a lot of people don't want to give away their offset information in the forums or in the marketing materials saying that that's some of uh, confidential information which really doesn't make sense to me because sharing is really important in our community to learn from each other. But I will put the full specification in the description and you can go and take a look in the link to see if this is a type of wheels or tires that you want to get. By the way, I did look into Vossen and Stance wheels, which are quite popular among Supra and other sports car owners. But these uh, variant wheels were actually better value, really well priced. And once again, the designs were unique enough that I don't look like any other sports car out there. So that kind of summarizes what I did with the wheels and tires. And the reason why I'm talking about this is that a lot of you may have an older sports cars and you want to upgrade to a brand new sports car. But before you do that, you might want to just go with a larger and a wider and a lower profile tires with a better wheel design. And it might give you a whole new lease on life because the car will probably feel different and handle differently. And you may not even have the need to upgrade to a brand new car anymore. You know, back in the 1970s and 80s, we used to upgrade wheels and tires all the time. But that trend kind of slowed down over the last several years, which is unfortunate because upgrading wheels and especially tires will give you the type of boost in performance and feel that nothing else can do. As I mentioned earlier, I also have a set of winter wheels and tires, which are purely all season plus in 255, 35, 19 front, which is a standard OEM size. 
and then 285 35 19 in the rear which is slightly wider than the oem i don't have them on my car right now obviously but they perform exceptionally well as winter set i didn't need a full winter tires because we don't get too much snow here in the vancouver west coast and i didn't want to compromise the handling too much i can talk about the all season tires maybe during the fall and the winter season but for now i want to share with you my experience with the gr supra with the new wheels and tires and how that can quite dramatically change the way car feels on the road Hopefully this is somewhat helpful for all of you who are trying to upgrade the wheels and tires. Again, let me know if you have any more questions. I'm signing off for now. Thank you so much.